Salutations friends, welcome back to my channel. Today's video I'm going to be talking about the new body mist from Sol de Janeiro. They partnered with Brazilian megastar Anita and I'm really excited to bring this to you guys because I wanted to talk about this and it smells good and let's just get into it. For transparency purposes, I purchased this. This was not sent to me to review. I have reviews and discussions on other Sol de Janeiro perfumes and body mist and products. So I will link those below if you would like to check those out. But I did want to let you know that this was purchased. Now, I don't speak or can say Portuguese very well, but I will just kind of let you guys know that 5% of the purchase from these fragrances goes to a charity for children in Brazil who deal with like heart and medical disease. I'll list um, in the description box, I will kind of let you guys know a little bit about that charity because I think that that's really cool. Now I thought it was cool and very um, proper. <laughs> they partnered with such a huge star and I like the idea that this fragrance smells very distinctive and different, but also feels very cohesive with the lineup. Now, what I love most about Sol de Janeiro's products and what a lot of people like most about them is the way that they smell. These are very in-your-face, sexy, delicious smells. And that's what Cheerios is about. It's about smelling delicious. So does this fragrance smell delicious? Yes, yes it does. It actually smells fantastic. So you have that kind of warm vanilla that is in a lot of Sol de Janeiro's products. And if you like that warm vanilla um, scent, specifically in Sol de Janeiro, or you like vanilla scents in general, you're going to like this. I'm not gonna say that the vanilla is the most dominant note, but it is definitely there. It's partnered specifically with passion fruit and pink patchouli, as well as some orchids. So this is a very decadent fragrance. This is a very delicious scent and it's fruity as well, which I like. And Sol de Janeiro has done other fruity notes, and I think when they do that, they do it very well. What I like the most about this scent is that the passion fruit smells very rich, very um, indulgent, but at the same time, it's very just fun and sexy. And that is what I would expect from this brand because that's kind of what they market themselves as. Something delicious, something fun, fantastic quality products in general, but at the same time, there's just a layer of just playfulness and flirtiness with all of their scents. Um, whether it's in their Boom Boom Cream, whether it's in their Body Mist, whether it's in their shampoos, there's just a layer of just, this smells fantastic and delicious and sexy and flirty and just awesome. And that's what this is. And that's what I really like. I find that this smells kind of more, less of a dessert and more of like a drink you would get. I like how the passion fruit smells a little bit more creamy, but it still has a bright zestiness to it that I enjoy. And I do love me some passion fruit. The smell of it and the taste of it, it's one of my favorite things. I love making passion fruit curd and putting it in every dessert I can. It's just fantastic. And I think the mix of the warm vanilla, the orchid, and the pink patchouli just make this a really wearable but very special fragrance of the lineup. I like how it has that vanilla in there, but it smells a little bit more lively. It smells more playful. It smells a little bit more delicious than some of the other fragrances. And I think that that's really awesome. And I think that when it comes down to a scent that's about loving yourself, loving people around you, celebrating yourself, celebrating, smelling amazing, but also doing it in a very accessible way in a body mist that costs $20, I think that this is, again, super successful. It smells sexy, it smells delicious, it performs as well as the other body mist, which as you guys know, I think the body mist perform amazing. I do like the perfume, but I don't think the perfume performs as well as the body mist. So when it comes down to bang for your buck for $20, you can smell really sexy and fruity. And I will say that even though this is kind of a fruity, sunny, kind of very decadent fragrance, the fact that this is, has a warm vanilla, the passion fruit is more creamy and less zesty, makes this a nice transitional body mist to wear from summer into fall. It's going to work pretty well in the beginning of like September, early October when it starts to get a little bit cold and brisk, but you still want to hold on to those wonderful sunny days of summer. So I do like this body mist a lot. I definitely think it's worth checking out. Again, it gives back to a really good cause. And yeah, that's my little review of Sol de Janeiro and Anita. 
so definitely check this out if you are so inclined and thank you guys so much for watching this video if you had the opportunity to try this fragrance let me know what you guys think below as always guys thank you so much i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you next time bye